Hey, my friends, man, I tell you what, I am so glad that you're back here and I'm excited to talk about the Howard Peak Trail Systems in San Antonio. They're greenways that follow along natural river points. One of my favorites is the Salado Creek Greenway and we're gonna start off here on the northern end of it off Hebner Road. Come along with me on this journey and we'll check it out. Hey, one of the things I love about the Salada Creek Greenway system, it's set up with over 15 miles of paved trails. As you can see, we have cyclists that use this. There's uh, people that walk. It is wheelchair compliant, uh, mostly level. It follows along these, these uh, creekways, a lot of greenery. Some places is in the shade. Others, as you can tell, full sun. All right, my friend, so I'm here at the Harburger Trail that follows along the Salada Creek Parkway. And in some parts, the Salada Creek is actually subterranean. Uh, the water runs underneath. It's part of the Edwards Aquir, uh, Aquifer Recharge Zone. Other places, it's actually a running creek like you would think of a creek would be. So one of the cool things about the Harburger Park, it's got a bunch of paved trails like a lot of the system does. It has offshoot trails, and there's a lot of really nice things here. There's a great bathroom complex. There's even a bike station where you could uh, fill up your tires, maybe do a simple repair. And all along the trail, system there's going to be emergency locators all along the Salada Creek Parkway there's 911 locator post so if you have some kind of emergency it'll give you a location that you can pass on and they know exactly where you are also along the trailway are trail markers that point out specific parts of the park give you a direction that help you along so to make sure that you don't get lost one of the things that I love about walking along the Salada Creek Trailway is the flora and the fauna you know there's a lot of deer here even though we're in San Antonio they live in these areas. So as you continue southbound on the Salada Creek Trailway, you leave Harburger Park and get to Walker Ranch Historic Park. And one of the cool things about this place, it still has a working windmill that pumps water. And of course, the playground and large pavilion that's here. It has special meaning to me because as my kids were growing up, when they come for the summer, this is where we take them and play and explore some of the trails. The next stop is McAllister Park. It's a huge park. Two main entrances, one off of Jones Maltzberger Road and the other off of, of the Wurzbach Parkway. It offers so much hiking trails, biking trails. It has a cool dog park, sports fields, pavilions, playgrounds, you name it. This is a great place to come and stop, either start your journey on the Greenway or end it. Our next major park on the Salada Creek Trailway is Lady Bird Johnson Park and it is a full service city park. It has a community center, a swimming pool, sports fields, dog park, and of course, the trailhead for Salada Creek Greenway. Our next stop heading south, Robert Tobin is famous for his faux wood-like structures that are made out of concrete. You can see some of these pieces of art all across the city. In fact, I'm filming on one of his tables right now. Make sure that you enjoy some of the trailways that lead either north or south along the Greenway. Thank you, my friends, once again for tuning in. And as always, stay safe, be blessed, and be the reason somebody smiles today, and I will see you tomorrow.